flipping get away from me! Run inside the toilet! Run! Oh, wrong time to reload! Nice of you to, to lift that quarantine. Where's my damn weapons? Where's my plasmas? Well, I should get for killing you guys. I'd need a bit of healing. going on down there? I think that's precisely the point, Doctor. God's work. I'm not so sure of that. We have to assume that the colony's problems are somehow connected to the marker. You can assume all you want to. I do not. The marker is glorious and divine. You... you know that. God moves in mysterious ways. Anyway, we'll have it on board tomorrow. You can analyze it all you want to. What are you so worried about? Worried? Captain, people are dying down there, killing each other. Is this madness the transformation unitology teaches us? Doctor, Terence, there will always be risk when the stakes are high. And here, they're enormous. <laughs> it could change everything. And that's what worries me. <laughs> that's what worries me. Is this maybe some a result of some kind of experiment? It's always a result of an experiment, these type of games. There's always an experiment gone horrible bit bloody wrong. Oh, and we turned them into mindless zombies. It's all our fault. Yeah, tell that to people that have died. Which way am I going now? I keep pressing caps to bloody run. Maybe I should make caps the run button. I keep seeming to want to press it. Okay, map. Apparently I need to go up the lift and back out again. Okay. No, no, through this door even. Ah, I haven't been through here. Ah, safe station. Alright, where are we? There we go, let's keep rotating. Look at all this writing. No God, no fear. No fear, no God, no fear. It's quite good. Okay, what's this one say? They are watching! Mm, they're doing a bit more than watching, they're doing a lot of killing as well. Maybe you want to put that in your next report. Biological Prosthetic Center. We keep you working. In case of emergency, proceed to the hospital wing of medical deck. Maybe I could use my kinesis on them enemies. Let me try them on the next. Come on! Hey! Come on. I'm coming! Oh. What, what? No. oh no, I'm too late. Oh shoot. No. 
Oh my god! Oh, what, you want me to go in there, do you? Oh. Fully charged. Oh, look, floating babies! Look at that, how creepy! Floating baby, oh my god. Floating babies. They little cell things. It's actually playing baby music as well. Now that is creepy. <laughs> what the hell? Get off me! Stop from it! Tell me that's not one of the bloody babies. I was going to say, I might try my telekinesis. I didn't have a bloody chance. He stuck himself to my face. What have I done? Have I unlocked something? Okay. Where are you? Telekinesis time! I don't think it works on enemies. I might want to just kill him now. I want to kill him now before he kills me, eh? Ah! How do you kill these things? Son of a bitch. Come here. I think they are them damn babies. Some kind of experiments going on here. Is that a pram? A little baby crib? Oh, God. Thermite, ah! Thermite. Alright, that thermite you picked up should be able to melt through the barricade. Use the shock pad to ignite it. Hope I can hold this position. I can hear something big moving out there. Don't worry. I'm coming soon. Just give me a second to fight my way through babies who want to kill me. Ah, oh, I'm back here again. Why is that lift moving? It's not of my concern right now. My concern is getting through that barricade and that's what I'll bloody do! Stasis! I like stasis. Okay, that's not good. <laughs> I hear the sound of- <laughs> Reloading, check my credits. 9,000. Is that enough for a plasma rifle now? I think it might be time to get that plasma rifle. 
shop. Oh, it's a flamethrower. How much is that? 11,000. That's a lot of money. Pulse rifle. 7,000. I'll take it. Multi-grade assault rifle with a high rate of fire. Anything you want to put into your safe? No, not really. How much space do we have? Red weapon icon. See your weapon has no ammo in its clip. Switch weapons, one, two, three, and four. Which weapon has got no ammo in it? Does it not take the same arrow ammos? It takes what what ammo does it take? What ammo do you take? You've got ammo there, look! Look at that, it takes ammo, it's lying to me! Plasma cutter, pulse rifle. I think it just takes plasma. Anyway, I'm gonna equip it. I'm gonna use a quick heal. And then we're going to go and blow up this thing. After we've saved it. I have the fear turn my bot. <laughs> I can't believe I'm called the theater bomb again. I've got the thing! I have the thing. What? I have the thermite. I have the thermite bomb. I picked it up. Okay, what's my objective? Come on. I thought I. Oh, the shock pad! Yes, I need to find a shock pad to set the, the, the thermite bomb off. Okay. Why didn't you just tell me that then? <laughs> Probably did. Hello? Oh no, look at this. This is bad. He's banging his head against the wall. He looks like he's been chewed to bits. I'm not gonna like this. Can I shoot him in the leg now and save me the hassle later? Look at all the blood splattering on the wall! Look at all that blood! Oh, this is sick. This is really sick. Oh, God. That has made his head flat. <laughs> it's got a big flat spot. Oh. I want to pick up the pulse energy. Thank you. Okay. Remain calm. And you shall always win through. Oh! Database. Medical log. Dr. Warwick, Chief Psych Officer. Report of Psychiatric Observation. Patient Harris. Harris is asleep after another strong sedative. He seems literally unable to sleep without chemical aid. Most people succumb to exhaustion after 50 plus hours of waking, regardless of any desire to stay awake. Not Harris. His explanation of events on the colony is also odd, and also and points to the same paranoia we've seen elsewhere planetside. His guilt is not in doubt. Two planet-side security officers were present when he took Dr. Schiarello hostage and murdered Nurse Evans, and he doesn't deny his actions. But he insists there was no crime. Nor does he feel guilt. This is a classic sociopathic behaviour. But Harris exhibits no other symptoms. He is affable and friendly, able to empathise and offer original opinions. When questioned about the murder, however, he becomes withdrawn and... Intransigent? Is it transigent? 
displaying schizophrenic behaviour, he also undergoes intermittent hallucinatory periods, again similar to those experienced by other colonists. Harris claims he threatened the doctor because he had to stop the dreams and the faces, and that he'll kill again to make it whole again. What that means I haven't determined yet. A most intriguing case.